Following the reconciliation of rent and addition of one-off transaction to be deducted off remittances, we are now ready to pay our property owners. To do this, we go to Financials on the left-hand side of the screen and then click on the section that says Property Owner Remittance. To remit, you first need to find the relevant unit and tenancy that you are remitting and press the option that says Select Transactions and Remit. This will list all your rents, management fees and any one-off charges being made to the owner that will be deducted off the remittance. And you have the option of ticking or unticking boxes in order to remit the transactions. There are three ways you can remit on Arthur and they are by unit, property or entity. To change these settings, you first select the name of the property owner. You go on the property section and firstly dictate whether you wish to remit by property or property owner. Depending on the selection, you will then go into the unit section and match it. Unless, as I am in the case of Johnny Smith, remitting at the unit level, where you select tenancy. The format to think about when deciding this is remitting at the tenancy level or unit level, they mean the same, means that if, for example, you are managing a HMO, you will be remitting unit one in that HMO. If you remit at the property level, you will then be remitting unit one through to unit six in that HMO. Watch remitting at the property owner level will remit not just that HMO, but any other properties that the owner has, and is the most all-encompassing way to remit. On Arthur, we advise you just to keep to your current preferences and remit as you do currently. So in this situation, I'll be remitting at the tenancy or unit level, and I'll then press save. I will go back to that property owner remittance screen by going to financials, and property owner remittance. I will then select transactions and remit and then press the tick box that says remit transactions. I can select the date where I carried out the remittance which I will say for the purpose of today is the 16th. And then I'll press the option that says remit to property owner. In order for this to synchronise with Zero, you go to Financials, go to Zero screen, synchronise with Zero, and then press the Synchronise button. And this will move the remittance to be reconciled with the live bank feed in Zero.